first section. So last class we discussed right a parameterization. So what is the parameterization, Rashikar? Just will Yeah, what is parameterization? Parameter means we set the date and the format. I mean, particular uh, uh, data. I mean, previous data, previous year. We set the particular data which is after that execute for a particular exact time. Which time will we execute? How many days we will prefer that one? Oh, no, I must exact definition. You are just saying from the like uh, how we class discuss, right? You are telling that. Anyone? Shall I say? Yeah. Yeah, it is parameterization. We give static input to the server, nothing but uh, what are the values we give from the keyboard, those values will, will be parameterized. Okay. okay. What are the parameter uh, types? Shall I or... Types. But shall I say or uh, someone? Yeah, anyone is type. Can I say? Yeah, yeah. File date and time iteration number, random number, user ID, group name, table, XML. Okay, okay, good. What is the like parameter properties? Sequential each iteration, unique each iteration, unique each occurrence, sequential each occurrence, sequential ones, uh, unique ones, random ones. Okay, what is stand for unique each iteration? It stands for user has to start picking the uh, data from first. First unused data point. Is yes, yes. The first unused data point. Uh, right. Uh, Anusha, what is the sequential each iteration? Uh, every user has to point the first data point and it updates on every iteration. Okay. Sunny, what is the random each iteration? Uh, user will pick the values randomly. Yes, uh, each iteration means it will update it for the every iteration. Okay, so Rashekar, what is the like uh, sequential ones? Kiran, sorry, Kiran. Yeah, okay, okay. I, mean, no, I, I think uh, some gap is happened, right? So, for anyone? Uh, for any iterations and n occurrences, also the same value will come. The same value will carry for every. Okay. Reason. What is the performance testing cycle, life cycle? Yeah, can I say? Yeah, yeah go ahead, run it. Uh, first, we have to see the proof of concept. Uh, in there, we have to check the what, are, uh, what is the application uh, business scenario. Um, what are the business transactions will be there? No, uh, which protocol we are going to use, uh, which uh, tool we are going to use. Uh, if we decide with the some tool, uh, if it is the load runner, then we will... Uh, uh, we have to decide which protocol we, we want to use and we will do with the minor uh, with the minimum users test those uh, after testing with the minimal uh, minimum users those uh, results will be uh, we will take that uh, copy uh, results um, uh, results generated copy and those values we will send to the clients and client will decide whether to take this or not uh, the budget also he will decide and then we'll go with the non-functional non requirements. There we have to uh, check with the critical business transactions, uh, PCAS, half PCAS, average response time, and the OS side statistics also, that CPU and memory. Uh, these all we have to uh, gather, the no gather under the non-functional requirements. Mm, yeah, here we will uh, go with the client, uh, doesn't know the application if the application is in production um 
uh, there we will uh, gather the last uh, one year of data by using some site analytical tools. Um, we will gather that uh, non-functional CBT and uh, uh, PCAS, half PCAS average response time okay. and other uh, statistics. And uh, if the client doesn't know the application, the application is not in production also, then uh, we will go with the competitor, uh, some network uh, trafficking tools. By using network trafficking tools, uh, we will gather that, uh, uh, again, uh, non-functional requirements, CBT, uh, response time, average response time, and PCAS, half PCAS. Um, and uh, if the client doesn't know the application, uh, the application is not uh, also not in production. Then we will uh, go with the traditional. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, traditional method. Uh, we will directly go to that uh, point and we will analyze how many users are coming, how many users are uh, uh, at what uh, what are the peak cost for this uh, application. Um, uh, yeah, remaining all the. Functional, non-functional requirements, we will observe directly and we will decide uh, um, uh, what are the critical business transactions, response time, average response time. Uh, so uh, PCAS off PCAS in such a way. Okay. And then the test plan. Yeah, shall I continue? Or? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okay, we'll start with a bit more. Then. Okay, yes. so thank you. But uh, I'm expecting from everyone. So for every day, I will ask for the entire questions. Not only for uh, yesterday class, maybe I will ask for the what is the starting class we discuss, right? So everyone will be perfect with the like la, what are the previous class also completed. Everyone will be no. So I will take for the interview section for the any day. But every day is uh, like la, what is the last class we discuss, right? That will I ask. That is fine. But sometimes I will ask for the previous class also. Please uh, like prepare well because you will get for the good knowledge so that is my intention so thanks for joining and we'll start our class i think everyone is joined right so last week we discussed like parameterization properties this right so sequential random unique uh, like uh, we discussed right so we have the one more uh, concept in parameterization that is the uh, like uh, we have the uh, different uh, the same line as some other parameter will be there. So how is we have the unique iteration same way? We have the one more property that is called same line as some other parameter. So what is the same line as some other parameter means? So for example, username will be there. You want to pick for the same line. What is the password will be there? You want to pick, then you can use for that. What is the values will be there in the same line? You want to pick for the that same value, then you can use for the same line as some other parameter. So that point of view, we can do for the complex parameterization. So complex parameterization, how to we can do? I will show for this. Okay. So now again, how we did parameterization, same way we can do. So what are the values we can do? First thing you need to know, right? So this username password we need to do for the parameterization everyone will be know right what values we need to do right so now username how to we can do we can select for the username what is the value and replace with parameter and create new parameter and give for the parameter name which value we are doing today sunny which value we are doing yeah. Which value? Username. Username. So we'll give for that. Why? Which yeah. value you are doing? You need to give for that name only. It's a good practice. And you are doing for the parameterization, right? Just give for the some underscore param. Means you are doing for someone will be C means, okay, username, he did for the parameterization. So everyone will be easy to understand. So your name give also no problem. Your script will work. But what will happen, right? Naming convention is very important because we are everyone is going as an experience, right? So by seeing also, they will identify, okay, this guy is not worked on previous. So that is why when you are giving for the naming conventions, maybe transaction names and as same to the, you are giving for the parameter names, you can give for the proper. So you can observe in our parameter name, user in that given U capital and name underscore param. 
So same like you can follow that. Okay. So after that, we need to select for the parameter type. So we have the different type of parameters will be there, right? You can uh, like, what is that value? It is a text or as a numeric or date. This is the text okay. file. So we can select for the parameter type will be fine. And after that, go to the properties. And uh, after that, we can click on create table and click on OK. And previously, we are ed edit with Notepad and we are edited, right? Now, no need to edit anything. Just to come back, just close this and click on OK. And if you want to replace with the where is username, Jojo will be there. If you want to replace, maybe sometimes some value will be there in many places in our script. Then if you want to replace, means you can click on S. Yes. If you click S, yes, right, you will get for the one window, see like this. So this is the original value. You are replacing it with this parameterization. So if you want miss, you can just find it and you can replace, click on replace. Then it is replaced. Now we have the username only one time, right? So that is why I'm not replacing. So now you can observe username param is a parameterization completed. Next, we can do for the password. You can click on that and replace with parameter and create new parameter and give it as a password underscore param okay and uh, this is the file type and uh, click on properties and here so we are clicking for the last time when we are did for the parameterization that then we click for the create table but now we are doing for the complex parameterization so miss like username username we said i want for the password like this miss same line as some other parameter so that is why don't click for the create table when you are doing for the complex parameterization, you need to select for the first dot file name. First dot file, what is the username, right? Here, you need to select for the username dot file. See, is already there. You can select that. This is the username. Now, you want to add column because I want for the username beset password. So, that is why you can select for the add column. Then, you can observe automatically password param escape. Then, click on OK. Now we can observe in username we said password also. Okay. Now you can select to by name. So which value you are doing? Password. Password, right? So you can select for the password. Now here, so when we are doing for the like we have that depends on the our requirement, we are selecting for the these types, maybe sequential, random, unique, each iteration, occurrence once. But now I want for the my requirement will be same line as some other parameter. Means what is the username? First two line is the Jojo and second password bin. So that line only I want to pick. So at that time we can select for the same line as some username. So the password is uh, depends on the whom. The password is depends on the username or not? User. Oh, yes. username right so for here we need to select for the same line as username then it is pick for the what is the username will be there just we are indicating on that so username is the first line what is the value will be there second line you can pick for the same so that is why here we need to select for the same line as username you can observe here it is there same line as username this is the same line as username, that is the same line as other parameter concept. So just you can select this. Now no need to select for the sequential random these things. So just uh, you can select that and click on close and click on OK. Every time it is asking for the replace point of view, if you want replace, you can click yes or otherwise no. So now I did for the username password. And uh, I want for the like username, password, first name, last name, credit card, and uh, what are the parameter values will be there. All will be same line I want to come. So then I will do for the complex parameterization. So now come to the next request. In this click on flight, we don't have anything. And you can come to the here find flight. Already you did for the departure date, return date. So this is the, there is no dependence. Any dependency from the username or password for the departure date and return date? 
maybe it is a dependency will be there also but this is the date and time parameterization we can't do for the complex parameterization we need to do for the individually how we did for the previous same way you can do don't including from the complex parameterization so that is the clear right everyone so now come to the next so here uh, you can come down and here you can observe first name last name address one address two passenger one credit card so this all details is will be depends on the who first name last name username, only. username only right because if username is not there where it will come first name last name address one so when we are here, then only you will get for the your first name, your last name, and where is your address you will get, right? So that is why everyone, like first name or last name, address one, it depends on the whom username. So now what we can do means we can, again, we can do for the parameterization, select that and replace with parameter and create new parameter. And here we need to give for the which name we need to give, Rashekar. Pradeep? Sorry, Kiran. Yeah, which name we can give? Parameter name? Pradeep? First name is... Yeah, first, first name. name. Yeah, so just I'm first giving the F name underscore para. Okay. So, now, go to the properties. Now, we are doing for the complex parameter. Don't click for the creatable. What is the, our... Uh, uh, dependent value username dot file for here file path you need to select for the username param dot file now again now we are adding for the column is the first name so just click for the add column then you will get for the first name param just click on ok see the value is k then here you, you need to select for the by name which value you are doing first name right you can select for the first name and after that we need we are doing for the complex parameterization so what is the dependent value username right so you need to give for the same line as username only and close this and if you want click ok if you want to replace you can click for the next so now first name is completed and next we can do for the last name also same way you can do create new parameter and uh, give it as a lm underscore param and uh, click on properties so previous we are clicking for the creatable now we don't click for the creatable sunny which we can select sunny are you there Sir, so, which one we need to select here? What is the dependent value? Username, right? So, we need to select for the username. So, everyone observe. So, it is coming from the dot. What is the parameterization extension file? Anyone ask? DAT dot extension. So, now you can select for the by name. Now we can select for the first name param for this here as a column. What is the column we are adding? You can give for this. And here, every time we can select for the same line as username. Because as a password, first name, last name, all, everyone will be should depends on the username only. So now close this and click on OK and always no. Then address address to so and uh, credit card expect that also we can include expect date also we can do for the complex parameterization no date we can no only... yes yes no right so because we can't do for this uh, as a complex parameterization because that is the date and time we need to do for the individually okay so now uh, we can do for the again I am doing for the, this is also create new and you can give as a address one, address one underscore forum and click on 
So every time I'm selecting for the file only because it's a text type only. So click on properties. So real time maximum we can do for the this way only when we have the dependence value will be there. So if you don't understand, please ask me if anything you want. Okay. So now we need to select for the which dot file. Username dot file. Username. Okay. But... And after that, click on add column. Then we need to add for the address one param. And here you can select for the address one param. And here we can select for the same line as username. So now no need to select for the sequential random anything. So just if you execute what will happen, right? Username, this will pick. First name, password is this. So miss, what is the first column will be there? So all values will be, it will pick and it will execute for the first time. Second time, again, second, what are the, in the second row it will be there, right? So second row it will execute. So miss, no need to dependence on the sequential or random or this type. So it's uh, like one-to-one -one mapping. And click on, okay. And no, and uh, we can do for the address one also. Create parameter address two. Everyone able to understand, right? Yes. Concept. Uh, Again, I give an address. Okay, okay. Sorry, we are not click for the add column. Now you will get here address two. If you not click for the add column, you will a column is not added. You are unable to see from here. So again, here we need to select for the same line as username only. Okay, then click on okay, then always no. And uh, next value will be passenger details. So select that value, replace with parameter and create new parameter and give it as a passenger details. And that's good for. And click on properties and select for the dependent value username dot file and click on add column and adding for the column. And after that, you can by name, which value we did password for passenger details and here we can select for the same as nice username and click on close and click on okay and click on no so now we need to do for the credit card also it is depends on the whom username only username only right so as a user name only it is depend for the credit card so I'm giving for the CC underscore forum credit card. So properties. And again, you can select for the username param and add column and add this. And by name, we can select for the CC credit card param. And here also, we can give for the same name as username param. So now I did for all values. So now go to the parameter pro here. You can click on here. So you can observe all values we did for the parameterization. What are the values you are given? All will be in the same row. So you can observe same line as other parameter, nothing but. So user one first value is like one to one mapping. Like this, how values is the row will be the right. It will pick like this. Just will execute and will observe that. Uh, just uh, save this and uh, replay this. So our script will be passed. Now we'll observe for the output window. So every time you need to observe in the output window only your results. See now come here. Username param Jojo. 
and password from you can observe bean means same line as some user parameter means jojo after that bean and how you did for the parameterization same like this spec you can observe uh, first name will be jojo and last name also jojo and uh, address one kphv hyderabad and jojo bin and uh, credit card number is picked so now if you want to add values means you can click on here and edit with notepad and uh, here you can observe so you can give for the add the data so username uh, will be jojo1 and password will be bean and after that uh, what is that first name again i'm giving for the jojo1 only and uh, again last name where is last name we are not did done okay so we are giving for the mm is a uh, address one and address two gpt and comma and after that address tip passenger details jojo one being is a third password and uh, final you can give for the credit card number so now just save this so now you can observe when we are open the edit with notepad it is uh, separating with the comma because you are here selected as a comma maybe if you want for the space you can select for the space maybe you want tab you can select for the tab so depends on the your convenient you can select for the anything is fine now we can uh, close this and uh, say again we'll execute for the two times and observe for the output uh, how it is picking from the values so in the run logic if you want two times means you can give for the two iterations for here and just execute here so now you can observe two times it is executed our script now go to the output window so observe for this starting iteration one means first user so which value speak you can observe jojo b means first two row only speaking and next will be you can observe password jojo and kphb hyderabad what are the first two row will be there all will speak for the first two iteration time now come to the second iteration ended first iteration now starting for the second iteration now you can observe here see jojo one bean one came okay so bean is came because we are given second row jojo one bean and after that you can observe for this uh, first name last name also jojo1 and again last name also given jojo1 and am from gpt so means this is the way its values will pick no need for give for the sequential unique this all things so everyone is clear this complex parameterization now for example you want to data more data you want to give means now you can edit or you can copy paste it or we have the one more option will be there browse also will be there so for example uh, already we i told right test to data preparation so there also you can do for the complex parameterization once you create the data you can copy or paste it or you can uh, browse this data so this file will be automatically it will save in the your uh results file so now we can go to the what is our script name okay this is our script name right now we can go to the documents in that uh, we use an okay and uh, scripts and uh, this is the our script right you can open this and uh, now you can observe you are able to see for the dot file username see this dot file so means this dot file automatically is created so 
if you want to uh, you are created excel file so where you saved right you can browse also is possible you can click on that and if you have that data will be there so you can select for the data for example this is also data you can select this maybe you already created in this data in the anywhere you can select the data and you can select it uh, i can give all then don't we have any data yeah test data will be the right you can click on that and uh, so this we are having no data maybe means once we created data you can use that data see now you can observe so i imported you can edit with notepad you are able to see for the all data so already this data already created some excel file i imported here means if you want to do for the 100 user test means you can do for the this is the way you can import from this so everyone is clear this concept or anyone any doubt regarding this can i connect sorry man first la add chesina par last name add cheyadu kada man middle la add chesukochu last name yeah we can edit Starting here also possible but editing thing is uh, uh, like it's not easy right so you can create for the excel and what is the data you are created there right that data you can import here that csv file okay so anyone any doubt regarding this but you can think one thing so don't give for the username password is randomly because this data if it is there in your system then only your script will be passed means if you open this uh, url like our application url so you are giving in the script means that is a registered user only it will work for the your script so that is why if you pick for the test data already i told right so many ways maybe it is a db side or already existing data will be there for example just i created right that is the existing data so you can select that data yeah. i don't know this data is available or not kiran 6 and kiran we'll see it's a random data i don't know that one see kiran 6 and password will be kiran see this user is not created means if you run this script right your script will be fail so that is why we need to go for the valid data so already we know right how to we can prepare for the test data script we can click on sign up now and uh, enter this all details what are the details you are entering this all you are entering means what we can do parameterization right so you need to do for the complex parameterization so how much data you want you can run that script and what is data you are created that data you can import from the in our original script then only your script will be passed. So like this, you are given Kiran uh, 7 Kiran, but this user is not there. How will your script will pass? So that is why when you are doing for the parameterization, we need to go for the valid data, like as a registered data. So how you are picking that data is not important, but that is a valid thing. Maybe you are picking from the DB or maybe already existing will be there. You can pick there. Maybe you are creating through your script. You can pick them and you can do for a keep, uh, like a key input from the here file. So this is the entire parameterization concept. So anyone have any doubt regarding this? already i told right you guys can work with a team work then only you will get perfect because if you stuck somewhere 
So when you are practicing, right, you stuck somewhere, then maybe you think about, I will ask for the Kiran, but you are maybe, I'm also not respond, whatever, maybe you also some work. So you are not practice. Maybe you are working with the, as a team, then if you stuck away there, then someone will be no for that. So it is not delay. So that is why please work as a teamwork. So how you are doing as per your convenient time, you can uh, as a pick for the team and you can do for the teamwork. Then only you will get for the good knowledge for the subject. So daily you are listening classes coming every day is not good thing. So tomorrow onwards, uh, like I'm giving for the today assignment, everyone do for the complex parameterization. Okay. And uh, test data preparation also, please uh, do for that. And uh, we'll uh, like, uh, maybe you can do for these things. Maybe again, tomorrow, if you have any doubts, again, we'll discuss as a parameterization only as the interview point of view, as same to the, if you have any doubts. And one day, like maybe day after tomorrow, they, like I will conduct for the one system test for the everyone. Okay. Thank you for joining everyone. I think uh, no one is talking back. Right? So thank you for joining everyone. We'll meet for tomorrow also same time when we'll continue our classes. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, Kiran Karu. Thank you. Hello. Thank you, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, performance center, the document centers are Andy. Yeah, yeah, I will share. I will share. Uh, and also, apart from this session, until my remaining while are the most of the actually monitoring tools, Gorinchi, uh, until um, brief guy na explanation kaavali. Until how to explain about it, uh, particular guy. Yeah, we'll, we'll discuss uh, like once we we'll come to that uh, section, right? This time we'll go into the some uh, like elaborate. Okay, I will elaborate more and I will give for more information. Okay. Until we will session a year, Daka wait chest, the Marku late out to Untunikara, so Daniki, then alternative plan chestara. Yeah, I will provide uh, meanwhile, I will provide for the 